good evening everybody <clears throat> just after beginning of the lockdown period we have started to helping the people through our facebook account we have got so many response from entire country and from our west bengal the people are calling me and asking me regarding their problems and other things i have got so many questions in my whatsapp number and i tried to answer all the all of them but it is not possible to give all the information in whatsapp i must say something two to three points regarding our homeopathic treatment there are some false belief regarding our treatment first of all i must say how we will be fine how our health will be good in every condition we have to do four things we have to do maintain the four things to make us healthy human being the four things are first we have to take adequate rest it is very essential for health to maintain our cell adequate rest means 6 to 8 hours rest regularly second regular exercise it is very very vital in this life most of us we are not doing the regular exercise we must do regular exercise at least 15 to 20 minutes regularly third what do we take our food we must take adequate nutritional food adequate nutritional food in our food content less of oil the food must be contain more vegetables more minerals which are getting from uh, your vegetables and fruits less carbohydrate more protein fruit we must take in regular way third one we must this is a third one and the last one we must have the positive mental attitude in this sedentary life we have many much many 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 stress in our life that causes dangerous to our health we have to be always in positive mental attitude we can take assistance of dhyan pranayam like that this is the four basic thing to maintain our health secondly in case of homeopathic treatment i have seen there are so many things are coming homeopathy depends on one basis that is called similia similibus curatum our medicine which we are using we are using that was given previously that was proven previously in different age group human beings and different age group male female both way and after that in case of drug proving is going on when is drug proving is going on we are getting so many symptoms those symptoms are collected and maintained and we have seen when the symptoms those symptoms are coming in another body in that case when are using that particular medicine it will act marvelously this is the main thing of the homeopathic medicine symptom Medi uh, mode of mode of operandi mode of treatment and there is a one thing in organa of medicine and homeopathic basic treatment we treat the disease we are not treat the disease we treat the patient what does it mean it means the one patient have a different symptom and other patient 
has another symptoms. You see, the one in case of fever, I think one thing in case of fever, the one patient may suffering from fever with different symptoms like one has thirst, another has no thirst, one was irritable, another was not irritable, one tongue is mapped, one tongue is clear. These all these symptoms can variate our medicine in particular way. So we when we select the medicine depends on the symptoms. He may be suffering from pneumonia, he may be suffering from common fever, he may be suffering from influenza. We need to know the what type of fever he or she has. But when it's, we are selecting the medicine, we have no medicine of pneumonia, we have no medicine on malaria, we have no medicine of common fever. When we are selecting the medicine, entirely depends on the symptoms we are getting. So, in homeopathic case of treatment, when if the patient comes to us, we have a detailed case record, his mental symptom, his physical symptoms, his family history or other symptoms we are getting. There is a process of case taking and from that we are getting so many symptoms. We are getting so many symptoms and we report repertorize and we select one medicine. I must mention this one medicine. In my 30 years of experience, I never do the polyprescription. It is not the homeopathic treatment. Homeopathic treatment depends on the single medicine minimum dose. We are selecting one medicine and that medicine when is properly selected, it is very tough to select, it is very tough to repertorization. We have to knowledge from, we have to take so many knowledge from different books and we have to repertorize, then we can select only one medicine. In that basis, homeopathy is treated. I have seen so many cases where getting marvelous result when I treat with a single medicine with a minimum dose. Single medicine with a minimum dose. I am a student of Dr. S.K. Dubey. I am student of Dr. S.K. Kanjila. I am a student of Dr. Vishwanath Shingupto. They are a stalwart in homeopathy in West Bengal. They are always treated the single medicine minimum dose. Dr. R.K. Dokto, I must mention his name also. Dr. S.K. Nayak, I must mention they are the stalwart in homeopathy in West Bengal and as well as in India also. Dr. Mohan Roshin, he is also stalwart. So they never prescribe so many medicine for treated one disease. So there are so many questions coming to us. I am not in position to answer all the things because I need to have to case taking, thorough case taking. Then I can prescribe one thing, one medicine. In this lockdown period, I just giving after hearing some symptom, just relieve acute or subacute cases. It gives the results. And I suggest everybody, when you have the chronic cases and other things, you must consult with your local qualified doctors and talk with them. You may you also talk with me or I suggest to talk with them and take the proper homeopathic treatment. I must repeat, homeopathic treatment properly is done when is selected one medicine in minimum dose. Thank you. I will come again later.